So I finally got this true dual exhaust setup installed. It's not perfect, um, but that's what you get with aftermarket parts on eBay. You know, this side was perfect. I mean, it just beautifully lined up. Great line straight down. Bam. And here you can see I had to cut that slot in order to get it to fit. Get this thing to rotate. The problem was, as you can see, it is looking pretty straight. But this side was like out here. And so the only way to get that set up perfectly straight was to extend that slot so that this whole piece can come more like this. More like that. And I did okay. So now the other thing I'm working on here now is the mounting, which I'm just going to have a piece go from here to here. Um, I may not use this bracket, but at least this will give me nice and solid. I'm not mounting to the swing arm, which would have been really funny driving down the road, seeing my exhaust bouncing up and down. But anywho, that upswept exhaust just would not seat right. It would not fit right. I couldn't get it to mount. So I like the look of this. One other potential problem we might have is the back side, because if you notice, this only connects in the front with one bolt, and this collar comes all the way around here. There's a little bit of a gap here. I can't really fit my fingernail in there, so that should be easy to fill in once I put the exhaust gasket in there. However, when we go to this side, I don't know if you can see it, but back in here, this is a much bigger gap. Um, I can't actually get a good picture of it here, but I'll take a photo. That hopefully will get filled in as well with an exhaust, with the crushable exhaust gaskets. Um, I might have to double up. I don't know. We'll see. And I'm hoping that uh, this will be the end of the exhaust saga. Until next time.